I've always been too scared My life is like sideways rain Just swells around in the air Been searching most of my life For anything to believe in Like a god in love is even Any honest is It's like my body and soul Won't look in I'll die soon anyways, and no one, no one have to explain myself. You serious about that? Yeah. Because you mentioned that too during the show. You said, who's afraid of uh, dying? Of dying. You're not? No. Not really. So at some point you expressed, you said, uh, during the show, you said you want to give people their money's worth. Yeah. That's yeah. your idea. I don't know. You pay a lot of money, you come see bands, and you can listen to their records. Let's let's take for instance the real rock and rollers. Would you like to end up like Paul McCartney? I'd rather be dead than be Paul McCartney. I'll tell you that. Or Phil Collins, or any of that. And so, you know, just try to. I know it sounds like some melodramatic, ridiculous thing, like uh, trying to be Jim Morrison or whatever. But okay, here's the thing. Yeah. When I was a kid. I read the book, uh, Ladies and Gentlemen, Lenny Bruce, right? When I was 13 years old, all I wanted to do was shoot heroin. Like, that's what I wanted, because that was my idol. And then, then I found Keith Richards, and I found all these other people, Graham Parsons, all the melodrama that went on through pop culture in yeah. America for 20 years. I ate it up, because I didn't have parents, and I didn't have anybody to depend on or to ask questions to. So Lenny Bruce and Graham Parsons and Keith Richards became my role models right so and then you, thus you, if i live like that it's not me that like consciously getting up in the morning well i'm gonna drink and i'm gonna take some drugs it's just me just because it's the way that i grew up you know it's the way that i formed my ideas boy where is this going <laughs> confession right <laughs> <laughs>